Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dan Harper Realtors. Well, today I'm out the beautiful Texas Hill Country town of Bulverde, and man, do I got a treat for you. If you're looking for a big custom home with an incredible view, you've got to check this one out. This house is 4,500 square feet, built in 2007, and the, currently they are asking 1.8 mil for this house, but on, and it's also on 10 acres. Let's go check it out. So this is the front of the house, but it doesn't do justice because it's, uh, the view is just so incredible. It's hard to show the whole front of the house here because uh, I'll get over to the driveway a little bit later. But man, this is, uh, you're gonna have just epic views on three sides of this house. It is on septic, located right up front. But let me go a little quick teaser of the view from the front of the house. Check that out. Like I said, all three sides of this house is just an epic view. All right, let's head on inside. Beautiful double doors. You got the little peekaboos. It's late April. It's actually quite comfortable today. That's why I'm wearing my fancy dancy jacket. But I love being able to come in and immediately see you out the back side to this pool with an even more of a view. Let me show you this one feature, this direction first. They got a little uh, atrium set up here with a door. The sellers just left this beautiful Christmas tree in here because uh, once you get it in, it's not too easy to get out. It takes some work, but it's a perfect use for it. It is air conditioned and you can do what you want to with it. Trust me, I am gonna show you outside, but right now I wanna show you the rest of this house. We do have the powder room set up here. Definitely love the color selection they did. Water closet with a door leading out to this pool. So this can be your pool bathroom as well. All right, coming in, you do have a bedroom kind of right up front. Let's see the size of the closet. Oh, like I said, big closet, but the, the family is packing up. This house is not on the market as of yet. This is a sneak peek. So if any of the, I'm doing this video for one of my out of state clients who this house might be perfect for, but if he passes on it, hey, this is free marketing for uh, the seller. And in today's market, man, you gotta know what's coming on the market before it actually does because things are going so fast. This is the door leading out to that balcony I was just on. So no need to go out there right now. But I definitely love this guest, ba guest bedroom with a full bath right up at the front of the house. Try not to show all the family's pictures to respect their privacy. Now, if you're gonna have a big custom home, you gotta have a bar. So here's the bar section. So beautiful bar. They've cleared off some, quite a bit of their booze because when you're trying to list a house, which I do those as well, not always buyers, but you definitely want to keep your stuff decluttered. And they've done a wonderful job of keeping it simple, but showcasing what that space is. But check this kitchen out. This is gorgeous. Definitely love what they did to the uh, ceiling. Neat little breakfast nook with a cool light fixture going up. Don't worry, I'm gonna go into the kitchen in a second. But this was the formal dining room. They decided to move it to a little bit of a different spot. And they put these really cool barn doors on it and turned this into a movie room with blackout shutters. So you can definitely, you get, they got their pull down screen right there. Built in speakers that can come down. You can use this as your game room uh dining room whatever you want to do uh, all right on to the kitchen beautiful curved bar going around very neat custom sink loving the brass finishes just don't see that too much but lots of countertop space this house does have a propane tank for its gas, so it's got a giant 
gourmet cooktop. And this is not a bad view to be looking out while you're doing a little cooking. We do have the KitchenAid uh, oven and a little convection microwave up top. Very cool. And check out what they did with this fridge. That's pretty cool. Just kind of tying it in to the ceiling. All right. From here, you do have a little dungeon-esque office. Let me see if I can get in here without making too much noise. So, very cool office setup at the front of the house. Plenty of space for a big desk. See, they're using this as a uh, workout room because, man, you got views all around you. I just want to point out the little rock wall on the end of the bar there. But check out this living space. Going all the way up. They definitely keep in that little Venice Spanish-esque theme. Pass through fireplace. And this space over here, they've got a pool table, but it's also a wonderful spot if you wanted to make this your formal dining room as well. But super tall ceilings all throughout. See the blackout shades? That's because the sun does set over on this side. And as the sun comes down, those trees provide shades. But when it gets up there, especially during the summertime, it's good to have those blackout shades. All right, beautiful fireplace, like I said, going on both sides. All right. Gotta showcase the all the outdoor living space that's in this house. They've got the uh, doors that can fold, close all the way out and close. And like I said, it's a nice day in Texas today, so they've got everything open. But check out this living space for the outdoors. This is all screened in, so you don't have to any worries about mosquitoes and uh, lots and lots of trees around. If you got rid of some of the cedars out here, you would have an even more amazing view. But yeah, let's go showcase some of this view. Yeah, this is just amazing out here. You do have a beautiful pool with a little infinity edge on it, but wow. <laughs> Lifeguard on a beer break, very cute. But uh, yeah, this, this house has enough privacy to where you definitely don't have to worry about getting your swimsuits wet unless you wanted to, because yeah, no one's gonna be able to see from out here, but this, this view up here, that's the JW Marriott you see on the very, very far out there. Owner said you could see the lights on that at night. But yeah, just if you're looking for privacy and a view, this, this is the place. Nice little spot where they set up for their little fire pit. And yes, we are going to go upstairs a little bit. I want to showcase that view as well. All right, there's a little shed they built for the pool motors. But yes, this is on 10 acres, but we are on top of a ridge. That's what's giving you these three-sided views. Oh, I just noticed a little pass-through here for if it's a happy hour and you're making some margaritas. You can pass those right out to your guest from this location. Very neat. All right. Loving the arches in this halls. All right, let's go ahead and head upstairs. But uh, yeah, you can access the outdoor living space pretty much anywhere in this house, including upstairs. So that's where I want to take you right now up this beautiful staircase. Like I said, more big, beautiful windows. Love and so much details in this house. A 
nice little sitting area up top with its own laundry room upstairs. That might be the only laundry room. I have to ask the seller. But man, check out this view from this upstairs porch. Talk about a great place to come have your morning coffee. Watch the cows out in the cow pasture. It's just beautiful. Oh, I did learn that they have just replaced the roof on this house. Because yeah, the house was built in 2007. Roofs do have a shelf life, but they just put on this beautiful roof. And that's probably gonna last another 20 plus years. So no worries about that. All right, we do have a couple of secondary bedrooms upstairs I want to show you. All right, beautiful flooring. Nice bedroom. What is this? I haven't seen this one yet. Okay, this is a little walk-in closet with, of course, its own little patio area. Let's see if this is probably going to the other. Oh, bathroom. Okay. So this is the same bathroom. They'll have private access to the bathroom that's also open to the hallway. Just gonna lock the doors. And you can have a shower tub combo. So yeah, one thing this house does not lack and that's bathrooms and views. Another bedroom upstairs. With another really good sized closet. And that goes into the attic, or I call the Texas basement, but it's locked, so I'm not gonna worry about that. Lots of little closet spaces throughout. Like I said, mentioned the atrium, goes all the way up top. So yeah, whatever you put in there, or if you wanna leave that Christmas tree up, you can. All right, let's head on downstairs. All right, now we've got the master bedroom coming up and it does not disappoint. Oh, before we do the master bedroom, let me look through here real quick. Okay, here's the other. So you got two utility rooms. I thought there was another one. So you have the main utility room downstairs and the other one upstairs. So yeah, if you got your kiddos that they can do their own laundry. But this also has a mentioned, well, they also have a four car garage, tankless water heaters and just a wonderful setup for doing a shop or whatever you want to do with a four car garage. All right, now let's go check out that master bedroom, more rock features. And I got, got them to point out, these doors are just super cool. Like I said, once again, beautiful flooring. Just love the little nooks and crannies that are in this house. Just super cool. And check this bedroom out. Nice sitting area, windows all around, stone wall on the back, and a fireplace in the master bedroom. Who doesn't want that? That's another little storage closet. But of course, you've got to have your access to your outdoor living space. But wait, there's more. In this bedroom, you have access to a little hot tub bed. So talking to the seller, said the hot tub is negotiable. But yeah, you can get to it right from the master bedroom and uh, be able to sit out and enjoy uh, this beautiful view from the hot tub. So it is a, looks like an eight by eight hot tub by Jacuzzi. 
All right. I have a hot tub and I definitely enjoy using it even during the summertime. We do have uh, speakers mounted in the ceiling. That's a really cool looking ceiling as well. All right, let's check out this master bath. Right when you come in, look at this tub. A little greenish shoe on the tile and the tub. Very unique with the green lights. But man, this is, I mean, you do have the hot tub outside, but you pretty much have another hot tub right inside for your bathroom. And of course, you gotta have a sauna. So let's see just how big this sauna is. Looks like a pretty good sized one. Yep, really nice sauna. And then check out this shower. Curving around, tile all the way through. And of course, you gotta have the rain shower head. Let's walk on through. We also have the dual vanities. Plenty of space and speakers in the ceiling here as well. We also have custom shutters and a his and her closet. This is gonna be a little bit bigger one, still carrying the tile throughout. So you do have a big closet for the hers. And then for the his, a still quite decent sized closet. Definitely love these custom sinks here. Oh, that's a little, that's glass in there on top of this uh, metal. Very cool. I remember one of those when I was a kid. A little Old Spice car thing, very unique. But man, this, even the lamps are quite fancy dancy. Love how they decorated the house. All right, let's head back to the main living space and we'll do our little wrap up. I mean, this is such a unique house. And like I said, these views throughout the house are just breathtaking. And like I said, the super cool hallways, beautiful floor. There's a lot going on in this house. I really do like it. Let's give you one last look at the kitchen and living area. Like I said, beautiful kitchen with that super unique, cool ceiling. Plenty of counter space. Your living room space with a pass-through fireplace. Breakfast nook with a margarita window. And could be a kit, uh, dining room area, could be a, a movie room. All right, before I do my wrap up, I almost forgot I didn't go out one of these doors. Cause like I said, this has a, it's on a ridge line. So you've got space all three sides of this house. This area here is what I want to show you. So you do have another door going out to this space. So if you have pets, you could easily do like a wrought iron fence around uh, this space here and you still have another area for cooking and gr grilling. There's more air conditioning units with, of course, this epic view. So you still have plenty of space if you got dogs or something, give them a little room to roam. All right. Well, if you're looking for a big, beautiful custom home with an incredible view, reach out to me. Uh, like I said, this house is not on the MLS just yet. They're hoping in the next two weeks to get it listed. So shout out to the owners for letting me come in here and do this video before it comes on the market. And for my client that's in Utah, who I'm initially doing this video for, let me know what you think. And like I said, if he passes on it, hey, free marketing for uh, everybody else after he, my client decides. But if you're watching this video, that probably means he passed on it. And if you want to get some more information about this house, click the uh, 
in the description box, click my link to my calendar. And if you're even thinking about listing a house like this, I'll be happy to help. But I can represent buyers in this transaction, so uh, feel free to contact me. And uh, if you like this video, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and as always, keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.